Hi, I'm Megan Anderson, host of Flow Working, the Entrepreneur's Podcast and owner of Flow Podcasting Agency. I'm so excited to have the opportunity to participate in Podcasting for Pause Weekend events supporting a contagious smile. I'll be sharing my fantastic story about how I turned my life around after surviving an 18 years in a violent marriage. The lessons I've learned over the past three years navigating PTSD, being a single mom, dating after 40, finding the love of my life, and developing not one but three businesses, all while finding my own strength and voice to thrive. While I may sound like a rock star, none of it would have been possible without my forever furry companions joining me and supporting this fantastic organization and their efforts to give people just like me for companions. I know from my life experience that how pup around makes it possible to move from a survivor to a thriver in no time. Hi, my name is Ed Cronin, and I am an author and a consultant and a friend of A Contagious Smile. And I'm happy to speak with you tonight and to invite you to participate in the upcoming podcast for a pause, which is a fundraiser. And I am thrilled to be asked to be here and to be part of it. A little about me. I am an author and a consultant, and I just published a book called Just Policing, My Journey to Police Reform, which is a story about my career as a police officer and police executive, and concentrates a lot about working with communities and especially helping victims. So I felt that I've had a common bond with the work of Contagious Smile, and I look forward to being part of this upcoming event. Thanks. Hi there. My name is Ryan Ray Harbuck, and I am the author of the memoir, When I Grow Up, I Want to Be a Chair. And I am so excited to be participating in podcasting for a pause put on by A Contagious Smile. Um, I feel like this event really is a great event to show what can happen when you put your mind to something and how far you can go and how far you can overcome any of your challenges or obstacles that are put in your way. Um, in my memoir, I write a lot about finding your true strength and um, this event is one that you will really be able to understand what that means. And I feel really, really honored to be a participant this year. Hey, Tess Scott here, author of Listen Sister, Finding Hope in the Freak Show of Life. And this is definitely a freak show. I'm going to be part of Podcasting for Pause, put on by A Contagious Smile. It's going to be the weekend of July 22nd to 24th. It's going to be amazing. So this is like a heads up. Watch for details coming soon. Save some time that weekend to be part of that. And you're going to love it. That's all I'm going to say. Good day, everyone. My name is Kaylee Mailman. I'm the host and creator of a podcast called Owning My Truth. By Owning My Truth, we aim to share, overcome, and heal by being open and honest with the stories we share and and the topics we discuss so i'm really looking forward to be uh, speaking at a uh, contagious smiles fundraiser event called podcasting for pause uh, it's a great great event and i'm so honored and 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 excited to be a part of it so um back in 20 may of 2022 20, this year uh, the universe brought together me and Victoria, and I was on her podcast. Uh, it was great success, and I was very shocked and surprised when she asked me to be a part of Podcasting for Pause. So you can expect to see me speaking on July 23rd, Saturday, July 23rd, 4 p.m. Eastern. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Hi, my name is Dave Campbell, and I live in Ontario, Canada. And I'm going to be with my friends at A Contagious Smile on July 22nd, 23rd, and 24th for podcasting for pause. Have you had a rough day at the office this week? Are you feeling a little rough around the edges? 
set your troubles aside and pause for this great event. Join me for the ultimate and positive, possibly greatest event ever. Fun things are possible, so stay positive as we embark on this special weekend. Unleash great things by joining us. I know it may seem like we're hounding you, but every Dalmatian matters. Find your girlfriend and retrieve her. How will this all happen? Only with your support. Last but unleashed, and in my rich husky voice, thank you very much. Hold for a pause. Join us for a great weekend podcasting for pause a contagious smile you us let's do this my best friend is a rottweiler his name is doc hi this is john and i'm thrilled to be part of the podcasting for pause and I'll be part of it on Sunday, July 24th at 3 p.m. Eastern time. Now you might be asking yourself, who is this guy? Why should I tune in? Why should I check it out? I'm a retired Baltimore police sergeant. Got hurt and retired very young. Lots of violence, lots of trauma. The incident ended in my career, resulted in physical injuries, it was a life or death battle, and multiple surgeries later I was retired. The emotional damage took a lot longer to get over. My life was a wreck. And slowly, with the help of a lot of people, began to build a life that, well, it's not the life I want, but it's pretty darn good. I'm a full-time FM music DJ. I currently do middays in Florida Keys. And in 2017, I took what I learned from the radio world, combined it with human element experience of the law enforcement world, and created a Law Enforcement Today podcast. Long story short, a radio station reached out to us, said, can you create a radio version? We did. We now are syndicated broadcasting weekly to 82 stations across the United States to about 28 million combined U.S. population and the episodes go online as a podcast. So I will be talking all about my journey and how my pets, cats, dogs, rescues, showing animals, all that stuff have helped me in my journey. That's Sunday, July 24th, 3 p.m. Eastern Time. See you there. Hey folks, Shane Boyd here from True Paradigm Group, and I'm here to let you know that on July 23rd, I'm participating in Podcasting Fur Paws, being put on by A Contagious Smile. Now, I'm looking forward to the event. I think the event's going to be wonderful, uplifting, positive, and talk about podcasting fur paws. I mean, who doesn't like pets and paws? I mean, honestly. And we put on by a contagious smile. Who doesn't want a contagious smile, right? So you know it's going to be good with a name like that. Now, I'm looking forward to it. I'm going to share some about my business as well, but mainly it's going to be an inspirational story about how to overcome the speed bumps in your mind so you can basically get out of your own way and unleash your greatness. Now, it's a fun speech, a motivational speech for an awesome cause. I hope you're there. Looking forward to seeing you there. Looking forward to being a part of it. And I'm looking forward to really sitting there and learning and being uplifted and moved by the speakers who were there. Thanks for being a part of it, folks. Talk to you soon. Cheers. Hello, everyone. Sarah Troy here from selfdiscoverymedia.com and theorchardofwisdom.org. I recently had the delight of interviewing both Victoria and Michael on their journey to bring a contagious smile to everyone. Right now, they are breeding beautiful dogs to be support dogs for those in need, people with high anxiety, medical issues, issues uh, post-traumatic stress disorder. We all know how important it is to have a fur one in your life and how incredibly intuitive they are and how they can be such great companions. Let us support them. If you join us on July 23rd at 1 p.m. Eastern, I'm going to be here to talk about that support. And I invite you to come to Self Discovery Media dot com and go to supporting the supporters and listen to their shows and i know that you're going to get behind them and all the work that they're doing they truly understand what it's like to go through the anguishes of life and just how important a fur baby is so let's give some forever homes to people and let's give them support for all the great work that they're doing see you july 23rd
Hi there, my name is Shanti Hershenson. I'm 14 years old and I'm a speaker, author, and so much more. I'm going to be participating in Podcasting for Pause, hosted by a Contagious Smile podcast, to which I've been a guest on and have co-hosted a teen talk. Being an author is my main thing, though, in case it's hard to tell. I started writing my first novel in the middle of the pandemic because I was, well, bored. That quickly progressed into writing nonstop each and every day over the next two years. Now, I've written 17 books and I've published 11. Not to mention, I'm currently writing my 18th book, Never Taken, which is a sequel to my most popular novel, Never Dying. I teach a lot of things related to writing, both on TikTok and in person, but most often, how to finish your novel quicker. I do this because I write very quickly and I think it's something that a lot of people ask me about and a lot of people struggle with. I once wrote the first draft of a novel in 16 days and speak a lot about building routines, setting goals, and so much more. If you put your mind to it, there are no limits. Hello everyone, I'm Julia Stubbe the Galactic Channel and I will be presenting at the FUR fundraiser Saturday, July 23rd at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. I'm an intuitive channel. I facilitate energetic healing on multidimensional levels and I just want to empower you to empower yourself. So the thing that I'd like to empower you with this presentation is to talk to you about spiritual hygiene, the importance of it, and take you and give you some tools that you can use and take you through a, through a few processes that will help you to be able to keep your energy fields clear, keep you grounded, and be able to have you know more ease in your life because you're not picking up everybody else's stuff and you're keeping your own body clear. We'll also talk a little bit about triggers, what triggers are, and how you can go within because triggers are an opportunity for you to heal with something within your side. So we'll talk a little bit about that too. I'll be taking you know questions from you if you have specific questions about spiritual hygiene or the triggers and I'm really excited to be part of this fundraiser for the fur cause for those little golden retriever pups and looking forward to it. So hope to see you on the 23rd. All right, bye. Hi, I'm Debbie, and I'm a life and relationship coach who helps parents of teens and young adults with mental illness or addiction to let go of their fears and live a life of peace and purpose while building a loving relationship with their child. I'm also an upcoming author and a mother of three. My life changed forever the day that I received a telephone call that my oldest son was found dead. Just nine years prior to that, at the age of 17, he had been diagnosed with a serious mental illness and thereafter became addicted to drugs and alcohol. I will be sharing my journey with you through the love and loss of my son through his mental illness and addiction and how I turned my pain into my purpose. I will be participating in the podcasting for pause on Friday, July 22nd at 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Hope to see you there. I'm Cynthia. I'm an author and a writer and a speaker. I have a disabled child and I know how hard it is for these kids to achieve and to accomplish because my disabled child would throw himself on the floor and say, I am stupid. I am stupid. I'm stupid. And that's why I like podcasting for a pause. They are out there trying to help these kids get their puppies. So I am going to get one of my books, Pursuing Gold, and let the highest bidder get a signed copy. And all of the money that you donate will go to Podcasting for Paws. This is a mystery about a Confederate bank. So whoever gets it will get to learn about the Confederate banking system. All you have to do is send me an email at Cynthia at CLSimmons.com and put bid in the line. And I'll get your bid. Thanks. Hi, everyone. I just want to make a real quick video um, and introduce myself. My name is Charlene Madden. I'm a women's empowerment coach, Reiki practitioner, and an absolute animal lover. And I am so honored to have been asked to uh, take part in the podcasting for pause event. Um, what a great charity. What a great event. And I hope that we can all get on there and support this event. I know personally the impact um, in healing that animals and specifically dogs have brought into my life. 
and I know the healing that they can provide in the lives of others around the world. And that is what my life is all about. It's all about promoting healing and sharing blessings with the world. And what better way to share a blessing than help to provide service animals. So I hope that you will join us for this event. Um, I will be speaking July 24th at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'm going to be coming in live from beautiful British Columbia, Canada. So I am super excited uh, to be at this event and to help create impact and change in so many people's lives. So I hope you'll join us and I hope you will support this amazing organization. Until then, we'll see you July 24th. My name is Jimmy Clare and I'm a motivational speaker, motiv autism advocate, author, and founder of crazyfitnessguide.com. And I'm going to be uh, presenting at Podcasting for Pause on Saturday, July 23rd at 7 p.m. Eastern Time. Be there, and I hope to see you there. Peace. Hello, my friends. I'm Rev Pat Flowers, host of the podcast Porch Talk with Rev Pat, and I'm here to announce that I will be participating on July 22nd at 11 a.m. Eastern, 10 a.m. Central, in the Podcasting for Pause event. This event is being presented by the Contagious Smile podcast. My beautiful friend Victoria has put this thing together and I'm inviting you to join us. Once again, that is July 22nd, 11 a.m. Eastern, 10 a.m. Central for the Podcasting for Pause event. Burr, y'all, F-U-R, pause, P-A-W-S. So guess what that's all about? Well, if you really want to know, join us July 22nd, once again, 11 a.m. Eastern, 10 a.m. Central, being presented by the Contagious Smile podcast by my beautiful, beautiful friend and sister, Victoria. So I hope to see you there. My name is Brent, and I am the host of the Fallible Man YouTube channel, the Fallible Man podcast, and I'm a men's lifestyle coach with a focus on personal development and self-growth. I also work with young people to help partner them up with mentors, role models to fill that need in their lives of a positive male influence. I am so excited to be involved with a Contagious Smiles podcasting Fur Paws charity event. I can't wait to see you guys there and get to meet you in the chat area as well as spend a little time in the cam in front of the camera. Guys, I'm just grateful for the amazing work you are doing by being a part of this amazing event and donating and helping us out as we try and make sure that people who need support animals get them. I can't wait to see you at the event and get to know you even better. Until then, be better tomorrow because of what you do today, and I'll see you at the event, guys. Hey, everybody. It's Dr. Stephanie as Faith and Victoria like to call me. I'm just jumping on to let everyone know that I'm participating in the International Podcasting Fur Paws events coming up at the end of July, the 22nd through the 24th. I am a pediatric physical therapist and I have 10 years of experience in the field. I'm going to be talking a little bit about breathing exercises and how important it is to breathe correctly to function at your best. I'm also going to throw in some general strengthening and stretching movements just to keep you guys at your best. If you have any other ideas you want me to talk about, let me know. Otherwise, I'll see you guys on the 24th. Bye. Hey, this is Lisa Sugarman. I'm a parenting author. I'm a nationally syndicated columnist, and I'm the host of the podcast Life Unfiltered on iHeartRadio and on iTunes. I'm also a survivor of suicide loss, and I'm a passionate advocate for mental health awareness and suicide prevention. I was also a guest on a Contagious Smile podcast a couple of months ago. And I'm also the mom to three incredible little rescue animals who have brought such amazing joy to my family over the years. So I'm a really, really big supporter of support animals and getting them to the folks who really need them the most. Unfortunately, due to a prior engagement, I won't be able to participate in a Contagious Smiles charity event. They're podcasting for pause, but I know it's gonna be a fantastic event and it's gonna be the ultimate experience on paying it forward. So I encourage you to participate and to give what you can and to support this really, really important cause. Cheers, friends. Hi, and thank you so much for watching the premiere of our promo video for our podcasting for pause. How it all got started is really quite simple. 
Our daughter was born premature and had to live her first six months in both the NICU and PICU. She qualified to obtain a service dog, and once we were told of this, we immediately began to acquire all the necessary paperwork and documentation. We even had our home visit, and of course we qualified. Yet, we were told you have to hurry up and wait, something we're all way too familiar with, right? There was a five plus year waiting period. During this time, I watched my daughter with a broken heart as I knew she needed that companion by her side. We had countless emergency room visits, more surgeries, more procedures, and we still did our bi-yearly check-in, but we always heard the same thing. We just don't have enough puppies for the waiting period is now gonna have to be even longer. My husband, who is a former canine handler, and I knew the importance of getting our daughter her forever perfect best friend. We went out on our own and found her. It was then that we realized that we ourselves had the ability to help other families just like ours obtain their fur baby sooner rather than later. My husband has not only served in the military, but also in law enforcement for well over 15 years. And you could even see the effect that Lady Reagan had on him when he got around her. If you listen to a, a Contagious Smile podcast, well, you know I'm a survivor of domestic violence and I've had over 100 surgeries to correct the damage that was put upon me by my abuser. I am also disabled now and qualified to have my own service dog. We knew we had the perfect backyard to be able to turn into a kennel system. We also knew there was going to be a lot of work that needed to be done in order to make this happen. My husband, Michael, who is also the president of A Contagious Smile, well, he created a plan that was really something to be impressed about. He himself began building the kennels. From the flooring into the shading, he wanted to make sure it would be exactly what the little pups needed. We ran into some snags along the way and had to bring in a company to cut down some rotten trees that we were worried if a bad storm came could really cause some danger to our pups. So down they came. Next, we had to bring in over 20 tons of dirt and build a fence that would protect our sweet new family members. We added in motion sensor lights, fence lights, a fence, cameras, and other security measures, and you began to see real progress. Michael worked day and night along with some great friends after his full-time job to make sure everything was just right. Countless trips back to Home Depot, getting all the extra supplies and materials we needed, and a good six months later, we had our working kennel system. We had no idea, though, how costly this would be, yet we continued because we knew the joy it would bring to those who needed it most. We now have five dames and one stud, and as you can tell, they get lots of love and lots of attention. With all the experiences and expenses that go into this, we are spending close to $3,000 a month in order to maintain the proper nutrition, proper medical care, and to provide all the love that they deserve. We have depleted all of our savings and have now needed to ask her help in order to continue so that we may help families obtain their ultimate best friend. To see children's faces when they get to take their pup home and know that they will give them that unconditional love and companionship that they've longed for, it's simply a puptacular experience to watch. There is no greater feeling knowing that that is your best friend because these beautiful, sweet, amazing animals, they love you unconditionally and they live to make you happy. If you don't believe me, just spend 30 seconds with one of ours and you'll see for yourself.